what? Might not have been started. Now it's, oh. I hit the red button, now it's saying. I guess we'll start this all over again. Yeah. Well, we're recreating this because I forgot to do the start button. I love the little box. That is gonna be so much fun to paint on. And the basket, that's wonderful. I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with that. The Vivid Polypore, I know that's for mixing with, I think, the Prism Pour. But you're gonna tell me that. And I love the two Prism Pour colors. Those are gorgeous. And the, the primary elements in that the tropical splash is just gorgeous. I can't wait to do these. Had a little leak on the deco art satin enamels, but that will be fun to, to do. And two canvases as well. You are unbelievable. You're the best. Thank you, thank you so much. And thank you for being my friend and my mentor. Hello everyone and welcome back to this international trip around the world commonly known as the acrylic crazy train ride. I'm so glad you're here. I hope you're enjoying it. So by now we have seen some deliciousness from the Joy of Pouring show with Cy Frost, Frosty Eye Candy. We then went on to Australia to see Darren Nixon with Venom Fluid Art. We then went to Christy Conley with Creations by Christy, and then Sheldon Briscoe with Shell Rock Art. And following me today will be our beloved caboose, um, and we will be pouring together with Lance Travis. Now this was a little bit different piece for me. Uh, this pearl mist was just beautiful on the canvas by itself. So I pre-painted the canvas, and as you can see, I didn't use a whole lot of base coat and I won't use a whole lot of flow extender around the paint. Um, I have another cup prepared that I will pour over. And uh, I just wanted to play with these colors and throw some pink into the mix and see what happened. You guys know I love to experiment and try different things, different types of pours. And that's what I did here. So uh, I, the way I topped it off at the end um, really, really gives it some pop. So I hope you enjoy it and I will check back in here in just a moment to let you know how I finished it off.
and here it is, one of Cy Frost's favorite paints, Rust-Oleum Glitter in the Iridescent Clear. Now what I did was brushed this over uh, the colored paints only. I did not do it in the negative space. And if my camera will focus here, you can see that it gives it a little bit of a greenish tint. Um, the effect of this paint is just crazy good. I love it. I'm so glad Cy recommended it. Um, on some of my pieces, it just really gives them that, that pop that they need. So I thank you again for being here. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, this piece kind of reminds me of a, a cosmic storm. Uh, these colors are just absolutely gorgeous together. And I managed to get some uh, pretty big cells in there. Don't go anywhere. Pouring Together with Lance Travis is up next.